Microsoft confirms Xbox Series X specs, 12 flops, custom APU with Zen 2, RDNA 2, HW accelerated rate tracing. Microsoft has confirmed the official specs for the Xbox Series X games console, due holiday 2020, think November. The new specs announcement confirms the powerhouse of a console this will be, with its peak 12 flops compute being 8 times that of the original Xbox One, and twice that of the Xbox One X, which already quite capable of powering true 4K experiences. This 12 flops figure is a mighty impressive one, just consider that AMD's current highest performance graphics card, Radeon 7, features a peak 13.4 flops of computing power, and that's a graphics card that was launched just a year ago. The confirmation also mentions support for hardware accelerated rate tracing, something that all but confirms the feature being built into AMD's RDNA 2 micro architecture, of which we are expecting news anytime now. This, alongside variable rate shading (VRS) support, brings AMD to feature parity with Nvidia's Turing, and should allow developers to optimize their performance and graphical targets without any discernible quality loss. Another very important metric, however, is still unknown, pricing. But with the new system featuring so many pieces of top-of-the-line technology, including SSD storage, this won't be a cheap endeavor. With Sony also keeping its cards close to its chest in regards to PS5 pricing, and the company even cancelling their appearances at PAX East and GDC, we'll have to wait and see how interesting these systems really are from a value standpoint. However, I have to throw my two cents in here, Microsoft's alleged approach towards releasing a top-tier, and top pricing, console in the Xbox Series X alongside a cheaper, more nimble system does paint the next-gen scenario as more positive for Microsoft than Sony, should the Japanese company choose to release a single, premium system, which some are saying hardware parts costs are set at $450.